This is going to be a video on the Samsung Galaxy S4 and how to extend your battery life if you're having battery problems at the moment. There's a lot of active apps sometimes running in the background that you can turn off. Also, make sure you don't have GPS on and other things like that. So I'll just walk you through how to do this. So first thing you want to make sure, if you're at home or you're connected to a Wi-Fi network, the Wi-Fi is up here. Otherwise, you don't really need that on if you're not connected to the Wi-Fi network. It's going to keep searching for wireless networks around you. It's going to be using up more batteries. Also, your GPS is going to be next to that. Uh, if you use it as a GPS uh, a lot, um, that might be on. I would turn that off. That really takes up a lot of battery life. The other one thing is going to be your Bluetooth. If you have a Bluetooth headset or you connect it via Bluetooth to computers, stereos, other things like that. That's also going to drain your battery life. And, of course, the more you use Wi-Fi, the more you use GPS or Bluetooth, that's going to drain it a lot faster also. Other things would be like watching Netflix, but that's all non-application related. So make sure you have those off. And I would leave Wi-Fi on if you're at home so you don't use up all your mobile data. Other than that, you're going to want to have, I have on one of my home screens, active apps. And so you click that and it tells you everything that's currently active, like I have Pandora running in the background, clock and email. If you open up several games, several games will be running at the same time. And that really takes up a lot of battery life. So to get to this active apps, you're going to want to go down here, click on the bottom left. It's going to be add apps and widgets. It's going to actually be a widget. So on the top right here, click widgets. And it's the very first one, it's this. So click this, you click and hold it, and then you place it to whatever screen you want to put it in. You make a new tab, you can put it on a current tab that you have. It'll place it on here for you. And then anything that you currently have open, you can end, essentially. I might have actually just went into it. You have to be sure not, you have to hit the end button and not click the program, otherwise it'll just open the program up. But it just stops the application in its tracks, turns it off so it's not sucking battery life in the background. And that's a great way to turn things off. Um, there's some more advanced settings, but in all reality, you don't need to worry about those. That's really too advanced. If you're having battery problems beyond that, there's probably an issue. And if you have any other questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks.